Hey, we're the Maltones. And this is another episode of the Smoke Break Talks. Smoke Break yeah. Talks. Because we're smoking. And we're talking and we're taking a break. From recording an incredible song. Oh, yeah. We just did the ZZ Top song. We went and saw yep. the Southern in concert at uh, Freedom Hill. So we've got a new release coming out just for you. Exactly. So, ZZ Top song, man. We wrote it my, for you. <laughs> one of my favorite. You know, growing up a punk rocker. Let me ask you this, Buzz. When was the first time you ever heard of ZZ Top? Actually, knew who they were? Mm-hmm. God, honestly, when the probably the uh, Eliminator album came out, okay. when I actually knew who they were, before they were just a bunch of old guys and beards who had a few hit songs. I mean, beyond <laughs> them, you know, and they got into that kind of a Mexicali band, you know. Right. Fandango. Right, right, right. Blues, but, you know. You know, they play the blues, but they don't sing the blues, I think is the old saying with ZZ Top. Okay. So, All yeah. right. You know, that's great, like... You know, my thoughts is these top. The first time I heard the Eliminator record, and I agree with you as far as the fact that the first time I heard that record was kind of probably the first time I ever really got ZZ Top. And, you know, growing up punk rocker and growing up listening to all kinds of different music, but that record, it just it kind of blew me away. You know, and then this is back in the day when you had MTV. And yeah, and the MTV video. They and, were right place at the right time. Exactly, you know. Yep. Those and it's like furry shade guitars and the crazy, uh -huh, crazy you know, car, uh, the hot girls. Mm -hmm. and, you know, and that's that's basically a, a little boy's wet dream. Totally. <laughs> hey, you know, and they totally are because they're not like that good looking at guys, you know. So they're, they're, all, they're almost I making fun of themselves. Maybe Billy Gibbs is the best looking guy. Well, yeah, you know, I've seen pictures of him when he was younger before the beer. He's not yeah, bad. He's too. Guy, he's a know? pretty good looking guy. He's just that too. Don't but... know what the heck he looks like anymore, you know? <laughs> yeah. But, you know, with ZZ Top, for me, they've always been kind of a band that's like, you know, I'm a punk rocker. I was like the Ramones and the Sex Pistols and the Class and whatnot. But you hear different music, and that's the thing about being a musician. It's like you hear different things that influence you. And, I also think ZZ Top was an influence on me. Were they an influence on you? Yeah, yeah. yeah. Probably more than I know. Yeah. Right, sure. You know, there's sometimes somebody might influence you and you don't even know they fucking influence yeah, you. Right. You know? Yeah, until you start writing some lyrics and all, you're like, right. It's like, oh, that's, my God. Yeah. Like, I can't you. tell you how many times I'm like, I think the, I think that was in a Cars video. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. And then, but, yeah, and then no. you, get, you get all bummed out. Like, I don't want to, I don't want to plagiarize somebody or I don't want to, you know, take their song, you know, but. Z Top is a great band. We got a song com coming out called yep. ZZ Top. We're gonna put a video to it. You and I had a great time that night. Yeah, that was and the first concert we've been, been through in a long time. Exactly. It's probably yeah. the first um, concert I've been to in 20 years. And yeah, I wanted to go to that closer, concert yeah. so bad. And you and I went to it. And it was it was really good. And they were great. You know, I know Dusty Hill, their bass player, had passed away. And I don't know, I think. The new bass player was Elwood something. I mean, he, he he just stepped into... Yeah, well, he was our tech. Yeah. So, yeah, he was and, been with them. So it for was, a long time. So and like he kind of looked like, like them, too, really. <laughs> yeah. I mean, shit. <laughs> but I think I, I saw a thing where he didn't have a beard, but he started growing one. Yeah. <laughs> you know, but, you know, the beard, ZZ Top's a great band. And they've influenced me, and I know they've influenced you. 